micro commitment. So, got you, the prospect, dance towards the sale, right? One of the big areas that a lot of salespeople make is they get to the end and they're like, so would you like to buy the home or the car or the watch or, you know, whatever, the RV or the boat or, you know, whatever, whatever thing is that you're selling, the finance package or the coaching or consulting package or, you know, the marketing package, whatever, right? You get to the end, would you like to buy? At least they ask for the sale. Most salespeople don't ask for the sale, which is not good. Um, but sometimes the reason that they get to the end and they get stuck is because they didn't really know, they didn't really kind of tie down all of the things up to that point to know if, if things were good. So with, uh, if you're selling cars, then maybe one thing you want to know is like the make of the car. Do they want Lexus? Do they want BMW? Do they want Alfa Romeo? You know, what do they want? Um, model, um, trim package, right? Features. And, you know, maybe those are kind of the main things, right? But if you went through this and, you know, you didn't really know some of the core things that they needed and you get to the end and it's like, oh, would you like them to buy it? If you missed stuff that you needed to get those micro commitments along the way, then there may have been something you missed and they say, I need to think about it. Then you don't really know why that is because you didn't really do a good enough job here, right? Or maybe if you're buying a, a new home, let's say you're gonna build a new home from scratch. Let's say new home. You would need to know like the lot, you know, piece of land you're gonna build it on, uh, model, which floor plan, elevation, how does it look, the outside, the structure of it? Um, and then the, those would be some of the, and then you would get into like the features and stuff too, but you know, oh, the community, right? Community, location, right? So, you know, if you, if you, if none of those, if there were certain things there that didn't work or you couldn't find answers to, that would be a problem. And so there's certain core things in whatever you're selling that you're probably going to have to figure out and you're going to have to get commitments on before you can go to the next item. And so when people get to the end and they just have no clue why the person is saying I need to think about it, it's, it's always because there's things that were missed up until that point. And we're, we're going to go in, into some of that, like that objections and things like that in more detail. But for right now, micro commitments, it's just important for you to know that as you go, there are certain key things like their hot buttons, right? hot buttons, HB hot buttons, that you have to check off. Are there are certain things that you'll have to know, right? And then by micro commitment, what I mean is you get the mini commitment, right? Does that work? So um, so maybe the make of the car is like, hey, so, so you said like Lexus is definitely what you are, right? You wanna look at Lexus. Okay, cool, yes, great. Da, 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 da. We're moving down the line. Okay, you said it has to be an RX350 SUV because you need some space in the back for your family and you want, you know, you want it to be comfortable. Okay, it's gotta be that. So yeah, it's gotta be RX350. Yes, it does. Okay, cool, micro commitment, right? Going down the line. Oh, it's, it's gotta have, uh, it's gotta have the S-Sport package because I still wanna look cool. Okay, cool, right? And then you're getting to the end. If, if you were sort of good with each other all the way to here, it's a lot more likely that when you get there, things are gonna work out, right? Versus if you didn't get all these little micro commitments of, yes, this works, yes, this works, yes, this is what I want, yes, this is what I The more, there's also research on this, that the more, the more someone has already said yes to you, the more likely they're gonna say yes to you at the end, or more, more likely they're gonna say yes again when you ask again. Just like if you, someone keeps saying no, it's gonna be more likely. So, because people sort of have, a need to be consistent, and this is one of these silly ways. If someone's like, yes, 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 it's going to be a lot more likely they're gonna say yes there. So you wanna be able to stack those, especially for the things that are most important, especially for the hot buttons as well. The better job you do with this, the more smooth this is here, the more you skip all this, it gets tough when you get to here, because then you sort of have to go back and do everything again, and that's really hard. <laughs> so it's really hard. So. That's that. Micro commitments, they're important. Short video, but, but gotta do them. So, moving on to the next item.